Namaste and good afternoon all. Um, I wanted to just address a few things and these things keep revolving, they keep coming up um, and they will continue I am sure. One of them is that I am a fake and look at you, you know there was one where there's a reflection of my hand in the video, I believe it was the Shanann Watts one and um, you know, a lot of times with those reflections, I just feel they're a bit distracting, but that one happened to be there. And it was like, you know, I'm not trying to hide anything. And, um, you know, if it's seen, it's seen. But I just want to show you something. And this is what I just, I'm just still astounded with people on this. And I'm not saying it's the ones that have been appreciative at all. These are the ones that come on and make all the judgments and are so nasty and critical. Um, you know, they don't have any open-ended questions or anything. And this is something that everyone deals with. But, you know, when you hold something, be it a pendulum or anything else, here's my hand. Maybe I'll put this up even more. You know, if you watch my videos, the pendulum is moving down and up many times. Down and up, it drops down. Okay, it goes like this. It'll move forward. It'll come back. Okay, I wonder how that can happen without my hand moving. That, that's my question. This is what astounds me with people. As you're watching it, do you really feel like the pendulum is leaving my hand and just floating around doing these different patterns and things? I mean, really, think about it. My hand is moving. Okay, that's the reality of it. And, um, and as I have said this so many times, and if people don't buy it, you know, that's their problem. Don't watch the video. If you think I'm a fake, a witch, satanic, any of that stuff, so be it. But go find something that is more in your line with so-called logical-based thinking, if that is even where you are at or whatever thinking you have. Go find that, okay? Because I didn't invite you here to watch these things. Okay, so that's just, I really want to put that out. Okay, that's very simple to push a few buttons. Delete, block, goodbye. Okay, that's what I do to those comments. But I'm just wanting to put it out again. Okay, so as you see, if you watch my videos, there's no, okay, my hand can be still and move. And the pendulum will move because that's what they're saying. Oh, that isn't how that works. That's not how you work a pendulum. And it's really hard to keep your hand completely still. You try it. Okay, this is with even holding your hand still. You can see it's moving. It's showing balance in what is being said. My hand is not moving. Okay, believe it or not, the pendulum will still work that way. Okay, that's not how my readings are done with this really stiff hand like that. And it's fine to do it. Pendulums work that way. That's the way I did it way back. Okay, it happened to evolve this way. I'm surprised by it too when it opened up. It just, the energy, when the pendulum moves and connects with the energy, my hand, you know, it moves with it. Okay, take it or leave it for what it is. I'm just going to put this out again. When you're looking at it, do you really feel like when the pendulum's dropping down and doing all these movements? I wish I could do it where it's just, you know, what am I doing behind the scenes? Going like this and it's floating. Okay, no. Okay, it's in possible. So really, I mean, I just, it's, um, you know, when you're moving your hand, dude, well, you know, yes, I am. I can see your reflection. You're moving your hand. Yes, it is moving. I don't have anything to hide. Nothing. Okay. Um, and that's the way it is. I can just do it and hold a thing, which I have many videos up where I'm holding the pendulum and holding whatever object or artwork and you know it's it's showing the movement of it there's also some where it's you know it's more um stable and either way it happens so they think that i'm a fraud because i don't know how to use a pendulum okay it will happen either way okay um the pendulum will move all right i'm not going to sit there it just doesn't work for me anymore with this thing like this although sometimes i do yes and no like that Okay, um, it will move that way, all right? Big deal, okay, big deal either way. Okay, take the readings for what they are or not. And that is your world that you want to live in with those judgments without any openness to really looking deeper. Without any, you know, spirit is a whole nother thing. It's a mystery. It doesn't have to do with your logical little, you know, 
things you have in there that line up you think just right, okay, it doesn't do that. It is beyond that. It's like, whoa, what is this about? Okay, that's that spirit. It's a mystery. It's magical. It's amazing. It's beyond, again, your little personal thoughts of how you think things should be or should not be and want to come on here and make rude judgments. Okay, so I go through and I think like, um, you know, just block, delete, go away. That That's so much of the process here. It's constantly weeding out that crap. I don't want other people to see it. I don't want to see it. So goodbye and enjoy your belief systems for whatever they're worth. I don't mind people having certain opinions, you know, if you're not rude. I mean, they're not going to agree with whatever's there. That that doesn't happen in life. And again, so what? You know, if you can say it in a decent way, then that's, that's okay. You know, everyone has their thing in that way. But for the most part, people that are rude and nasty have. And I've had several that come on and they say, I don't get it. How does this work? Well, you know, I, I do, do my best to explain things. You know, words aren't going to categorize. I don't know. It just happens. Believe it or not, there's a lot of that in the universe. How do flowers grow? I don't know. They just do. Okay. How does rain come? I don't know. It's just there. Are you going to go through? Why don't you study about it? Okay. All the books you can and you still won't get it. All right. So I just wanted to say that, that yes, my hand moves. Okay. It can move. It, the pendulum will still move even if I keep my arm stable. That's the way it happens. Okay, the next thing is I am doing all of the readings for profit. Okay, that I charge $25 of which I get on PayPal 23 something. All right, for a reading that many times is literally a half hour. The other day it took me a lot of the day to upload it and then I go back and I'm not saying this is anything bad. I don't mind. I'm one that monitors everything. I want to answer things. I want people to feel like they're being heard. You know, but I will tell people no, or there's certain boundaries. I'm not going to do this at this time, or that's not coming out now, you know. And, um, okay, so with the readings, that's how much I make. Um, I do go through whatever questions they have in regards to it. I will take my time to answer it beyond that, to complete whatever. This is just as an offering, as a give and take. Okay, if you look on any of the Tro sites, they also charge money. All right, they charge $25 to $50 for a reading. Okay, if you go to a Tro reading, if you go to a service, if you go for a massage, if you go for energy work, Reiki, you know, that people pay a ton of money for, they, but this, for some reason, I'm doing it for profit, okay, which, uh, and I've answered way, way more and done way, way more work for nothing. You know, all the videos on here um, are not for anything, and I answer all the questions under there, and again, I'm not trying to say, oh, look at me, I do this. I don't care. I'm trying to answer and, and explain this situation, Okay, I know I'll get all these things again, and you know, we'll go through it again. But, um, or you say it can't be learned, well, that means you're a fake, you're a fraud. You know, there, there's just, I, I just can't be, I'm sorry. I wish I had a list of start with this and then do this and connect with that and see how it's working now. I don't with the pendulum, the way it works. I just don't. You know, the proof is in the pudding. If it speaks to your heart, if you can see that there is accuracy in the readings, um, which thus far there have been, and you can even see it, you know, check those out. Um, you know, they a lot of them will say, well, there's facts in there, but then you're making up the rest of the shit. That's what some, you know, I'm like, no, I'm not. Okay, the readings, it doesn't matter what it is. They flow from the exact same heart, from the same space, the same way. Okay, whether it comes out as something that's in the news, like a murder or crime thing, you know, something that comes out where it's, you know, someone's hurting about something, something that comes out where, you know, um, you know, they have some depression. I don't care what it is. You know, just a piece of artwork can be read, a crystal. Okay, everything has a story, an energy pattern that is read. It's all the same, really. And it all flows with the exact same energy, with the exact same life force. There's nothing, one iota of difference in it, okay? I don't make anything up. Okay, um, this is not where I am in my world. I've walked a spiritual path for many years, which the foundation is honesty, transparency, integrity. I don't know how that spells out being a fake, try to lie to people, con people, get a lot of money from people. Okay, where is that in there? I would 
be a terrible student, okay, if I really did that. Okay, my name's Siddhananda, okay, that was given by my guru, you know, due to certain vows that I took to be honest and to, um, you know, have integrity uh, and, and many, much more that's much deeper and richer. And I would never, ever dishonor that, okay? I've worked with my guru. She knows how I work. Um, if she felt for one minute I was conning anyone, believe me, I'd be done. And I would never do that. Take it for what it is. Okay, I'm just putting this out there because it gets old, but you know, it'll come again because people don't look at all. They just have these knee-jerk reactions to things. Okay, so I'm going to put this out this evening. Um, and uh, I am getting a few more requests for readings and various things. And um, it's been, I've like I say, I've gotten really good feedback on that. And uh, Someone said, oh, do you do therapy sessions? You know, because she thought it was, you know, it is, it, I guess it ends up being therapeutic. I'm not looking to do that, but it really will give um, some way through things and some way to rise higher in consciousness. You know, just naturally it comes. Um, I Therapy, I don't want to put anything on it. No, I mean, I just, if any of the readings that you want done, it's going to come out the same. So you're welcome to call it what you like, but uh, it'll work with anything. Okay, so I guess that's it for this evening. Now, I think what I'm going to do this evening is just purposely go through and read things and, you know, move my pendulum around however I feel like it feels right and makes me look good. I'm just going to go around doing that now, okay? Doesn't that feel good? Have a good night, okay? Bye now.